In order to succeed in the future, you have to have good results today. Uh, Atco Gas is one of the top performing utilities in North America. From a safety perspective, a customer response perspective, and even from an operations or an affordability perspective. So that's a really important point to start from in order to look at a future strategy. As we look towards our future, it's taking that strong operational results and looking at things like energy transition. Obviously, as a natural gas utility, one of the most important things we need to look at is how we're part of a future where it's either net zero, lower carbon, you know, decarbonized heating. So here at Aqua Gas, a lot of what we've done is we've been innovating, particularly over the last five to seven years, and we've zoned in on hydrogen as we're looking at our strategy to the future. The main reason is that it's the most affordable path towards net zero. And we've been working with government, industry, all different stakeholders on how do you get that hydrogen economy to really take off as far as a market perspective. So where we see us heading is by 2030 having a blend of hydrogen within our networks. That helps not only decarbonize our customer's footprint, but also sets up a market for hydrogen. We've then got further plans that look at 100% hydrogen out by 2050, and that's really key to how you can get to net zero as you look at a natural gas utility. One of the questions I get a lot is, when you look at a net zero future, how do you reconcile that with a natural gas utility? And I actually think that by utilizing the infrastructure that's already there, the investments that have been made, and having a path with a natural gas utility drives the affordability for those end customers. There has been investments made throughout the world that we can learn from. And what we're seeing in places like the UK and in Europe is that push away from the gas system has actually driven costs up. And you're seeing people come back towards natural gas as an energy source. So there's a strong future for gas and there's a lot of opportunity to invest in energy transition technology. And I think in the end, I know there's a strong future for the gas network and we've got multiple paths that we can use to be part of a net zero future. I think one of the great things about working within ATCO is even though there's been an increased focus on environment, social and governance, or ESG as everybody seems to know it as, we've been living those values for the last 20 years. And the decisions we've made around where we take our business, what our future strategies are, whether there was an ESG focus Today or not, we would be making those same investment decisions that are required. We are a trusted partner as municipalities, governments, our customers look for who can they turn to when they're down. And I truly believe that we're one of those companies they can turn to.